Hi, my name's Celeste Forrest. I live in Connecticut. I'm here to discuss what's trending all over the United States right now, pandemic pods. Pandemic pods are also known as learning pods. So what this is, is people around the United States right now, a lot of parents are afraid to let their kids go back into the school system. Maybe it's lack of social distancing, lack of masks, maybe it's not enough testing, things like that, and too much exposure on the bus. So people are turning to have private instructors come into their home to help their kids with their schoolwork. Well, that's where we come in. My friend T and I are both educators and I've been an art teacher for seven years now. And um, Tia was a reading instruction person. She also runs camps. So her company is called Creative Vista Charm. It's located in Connecticut, and we are going to be doing pandemic pods for the whole state of Connecticut. How does it work? Well, what you do is contact Tia. She'll set up um, a webinar for you to watch so to answer most of your questions. We have a teacher come in for three hours a day. You can have up to six kids in a pod. You could cherry pick your pod kids. They could be your friends, your relatives. It could just be neighbors. Um, if you don't have anyone you want to be in a pod with, we can try to match you up with some kids so that we go into someone's home that's an enclosed area, preferably outside when the weather's nice. The teacher wears a mask and a face shield. We are there to support distance learners. So they already have their curriculum given by their public school. Maybe they are using Google Classroom or Seesaw or whatever format. And we are going to be circulating, helping the kids do their schoolwork in those three hours. We are, I'm a certified art teacher. I have a master's degree in technology. I also teach private art lessons online remotely. Um, I'm also cross certified to be a school librarian. So the teachers that are coming in, we have that experience. Uh, we're not just babysitters. We have teaching experience. Um, we know how to help them learn and help them uh, work through problems. This is a safer, you know, way to go for having a smaller social circle. A lot of parents are saying, hey, I'm letting my kids go to school because they need socialization. They're so bored. I totally get it. Um, with the pod system, at, you, at least you're gonna be with the six same kids all the time. So then it's a little bit safer, less exposure, but they're still getting some social time to have someone to hang out with, talk with. Um, I have three kids of my own, so I get it. I have a daughter who just graduated high school and I have two kids that are, one's gonna be in middle school, one's gonna be in elementary. I'm going to have them do distance learning and I'm going to help them with it. Uh, my mother-in-law is going to watch my kids while I teach pods. And I also teach private art lessons remotely for kids all over the world, which I love doing as well. So if you have any questions and you're interested, in, if you're in Connecticut and you're interested in learning more about learning pods, about pandemic pods, please look at the link below. Um, there's a flyer. Um, you can contact Tia. She'll send you a webinar where we answer pretty much every question we could possibly think of. We are moms. We think of everything. And I hope, you know, we can help a family out in Connecticut. I hope that, uh, I know it's a stressful time. I've been exhausted. I've been crying. I've been stressed. I've been trying to figure out what to do. And so I think this is a great solution for those who can do it. And we're here to help. Um, I know not everyone can afford a pod. Maybe it's too expensive for you. Um, in that case scenario, let's say you have three families and every person has two kids. Let's say your friend is more well off than you are. You can see if they'll, the pod is a one price per group. So if someone wants to pay less and someone can pay a little more, you can do that. We're also reaching out to nonprofits in Connecticut um, and communities and companies to see if they'll sponsor a pod for inner city kids because we want to give back to the community as well. So nice seeing you. My name is Celeste Forrest. Good luck with whatever you decide to do with with schools. I know it's not an easy decision no matter which way you go. We're here to support you. Create a Vista Charm LLC. Bye-bye.